here. Remember when I said I was going to find that uh, Floyd mission or whatever in Eshabone? I found it. I remember where it was. I was saying, the room of the Magenta Key. I completely forgot. There is a Life Force door over here. It's in here. I was trying to remember. I remember running into it when I was Lupus on this planet. Now I remember it? We are here. So, I may as well get this knocked out since I'm here. It's nice though you don't have to be Juno to do these. And again, I kind of do that, but just have to do it with Juno most of the time anyway. So, I'll collect at least eight DNA strands and reach the finish in time allowed. Okay. So, anyway, welcome back, everybody, to more Let's Play Jet Force Gemini. This is your host, the MJ406. And, well, looks like we got another Floyd mission in Eshipo to try to collect all this stuff. And there are 24 DNA strands. You gotta get 8 to beat it, and 24, you gotta find all of them in order to fully clear the mission. So it looks like that's what I gotta do to go for my expert medal or whatever. Well, here I go. For lots and lots of pain. Right. I see. So I'm gonna have to shoot everything. I don't know why I didn't think about that, but yep. Basically, I gotta figure out the right way to get to every single DNA strand. That is going to be obnoxious. And I gotta be able to fly to every single one of them. Jeez, man. You didn't go anywhere near what you needed. Okay, then. So, yep. Basically, gonna try to know where all the right ways are to get all of them. Is it that way or this way? I wonder. Do I have to, like... Hmm. I'm trying to think about how I have to go about this, because there's probably a lot of them all over the place, but... There's 24. Which means they probably want me to navigate the whole area, too, to find those I couldn't get before. I got 12 just going this way. At least actually, like, trying to do it right. There's your bronze metal! That's just for being a general. Okay. But yeah, I guess you have to get the expert medal at a certain time. To get the expert medal, I think you probably have to do it all at like a certain time limit. Ah, uh, okay. I think I get it. You're going the wrong way if you start seeing these paths with the teeth or whatever those are. So if you see the teeth, you do not want to go that way. Okay. I get you now. That makes more sense. All right. Let's give it another try, and then I guess I'll time warp to figure out exactly what I'm trying to do here. So basically, just keep navigating so you can avoid the teeth. If I do it right, then, well, I'll be able to get all the stuff I need. I get used to freaking turning around, too. It's a real pain in the ass to try to get all this. Like, how the hell? So really, I have to explore and try to learn where everything is. If I really want to find all of it. Yeah, basically, I just gotta get good at exploring this place quickly. Which is going to suck. I'm already having a difficult time. I can't tell if it's, like, a balance between how much of the mission I do and how quick I am. But it looks like for some of it, I actually have to, like, be perfect in the mission in order to be able to get what I need. I'll probably go here, turn back around, and get the last ones. Oh, that's teeth again. Oh, there's another one over here, though. Jeez. This place has so much to it. Yep, I got those ones. Did I get all of them? There's one path I didn't find yet. Oh, God. So I have to find all of these in a short amount of time, and freaking... Wow, okay. That is ridiculous. That is actually one hell of an order to try to find all these that quickly. So I just have to explore to my heart's content to try to find everything. That is insane. That's a lot to do. That is a lot. So pretty much you have to just find the best way there. Mary is just the completion one. Okay. Let's time up to be somehow getting all this. Which is going to be a massive pain in the ass, mind you. It is time to fly around and wonder where everything is. There's no way I'm going to find them all in such a short amount of time. And again, it all depends on how back and forth I really have to go through this thing. As long as I'm careful with the teeth, I guess I'll be alright. 
I really have to make sure I hit all those as I move around. Because otherwise, I'll just be wasting my time. Just follow the DNA! Perhaps that will be the key to me figuring out where I must go. So, let's see if this is the one. I don't know how many I have so far, but I doubt it's enough. God damn. This is just a lot to deal with trying to actually get all these. I wonder if it was enough. So yeah, through here is the path to the end. I just have to turn around, get this one, and then come back. Okay, I know my route now. And it got me a target range! Ooh! Wow, okay. I don't know where the target range is. Hmm. Is that something for, like, a multiplayer, maybe? Maybe, I don't know. Let me just see if that was the expert metal run. If it was, that would have been surprisingly fast. Maybe it was at least gold. It was gold. Okay, so I got gold for it. All right. But I still need to get expert, so I need to do it even faster. Well, you guys saw how I had to do it now, so I'm just going to skip my run and just show you when I get the expert medal, so you'll see the time you need to get all the DNA strands. Maybe I did that one run, though. That was pretty sweet. Damn right, baby. I did it under 55 seconds, so I got it. Why don't they give you a minute? I even struggled a little bit in that, but that was... All right, fine. Good. Now with that, we're done with that. So, we got another one. There's probably another Floyd mission out there. I just don't know where. So now that's done. Well, since I was here first, let me go to the water ruin of Vila. It's time to see what we can uncover here. Come! There's probably a lot hanging out down here. I just don't know where. I mean, I'd be surprised if Vila is not the character for this. I mean, come on. It's water ruin. Her name is basically screamed that she is the one that has to be here. Look at that. There's a tribal hanging over there, too. I see multiple tribals hanging around. Are they stranded? I mean, don't you guys have a ship? No. You know, that actually makes sense. Damn it. Are you at least safe up there? Probably. Ah! Not anymore. No longer safe. You're not coming with me to be captured and tortured. Huh. What a weird, small, desolate planet just thrown in the middle of nowhere. Ooh. I wonder. I wonder if everybody can get something here. There's another one of those things I should look for. This happens to be time mines. Ooh. Another trigger set fuse like, or just tap it for proximity mode. Oh, okay. So a new mine. All right. Good. Oh, wow. What the? It's going to be really hard to climb up to these guys. Unless, of course, there's a jet pad spot somewhere. Right? Right? No? Hmm. I'm sure there's somewhere to launch from. Either that or something to climb that I haven't seen yet. Then again, hard to tell in an area like this. It's either that or I somehow have to... Oh! End up high. One way or another, I will figure out how to save you all. No matter how long it takes. Oh god, this could take a long time. Suck it up. If you want to get all the tribals, you better be learning how to climb up to them. What the heck is that? Is that a panda bear? Hello, sailor. I'm a panda bear. It's all been kicking off, hasn't it? I thought I'd come in to hide out here until everything blows over. Thing is, some of these noisy tribals have the same idea. They keep waking me up. I'm starting to get, a crouch, get crouchy now. What I'd give for a pair of earplugs. Hey, you knew this is a cargo ship. If you're headed that way, see if you can get that little robot of yours to rustle up something useful, okay? Oh, you get a hit for that, huh? What do you think I'm carrying, Goop? You're as bad as those tribals. What do you got that could help me get to sleep? Nothing. That's what. God, scoot. Oh, uh, okay. Let's go away very quietly. So I need to get Judo here just so he can give you that freaking... He does have the earplugs. Man, I sent him over there, too. What a waste of time I put myself through. All right, let's get you back over here, Juno. All right, I made it to the castle, and that bear is still here. But now that I have Juno, he's the one that has the earplugs. So, 
I can give it to this bear. I have to talk to it. Oh god, please don't hurt me, bear. Here, just take us. Aha! Now those earpugs might just do the trick. Can I have them? Nah. No, thank you. Just a ticket. Thanks. I'll take this little bit of junk and give me some peace, okay? Wow. Alright, so I got a ship part for that. Alright, good. And with that, I now want to go back to using Vila because. Again, water travel. I wish to use you to get everything I need here, Vila. Get to it, again. Now I gotta do it all over again, too. What a pain. I could always go to the underwater cavern, but, yep. That is the one thing that stinks with the inventory. Only certain characters can hold certain items. So you gotta remember, if you pick up one of those special items or whatever you might need from the Floyd missions, you gotta make sure the character you did that with is present for when you have the when you're finding the location that you can get rid of that thing. Ugh. How dumb. I kinda wish they could all just share inventory. Then again, that would make the game too easy, wouldn't it? I kinda wanna have everybody go on their own little adventures, so. It makes no sense to do it that way. Why would you make everybody share inventory? Hell, why would you make everybody travel together? It makes no sense at all. Yeah. But still things I wish I could do. So maybe let's explore underwater, see if I can uncover something. Because I'm sure I'll find something interesting if I just swim and search enough. Ah, look at that. What is that? It's a thing. Another ship part, jeez! How many do I have now? Like seven or eight? Shit. If you go to special, we can see the parts we have right now. Okay, we have the power cell. I think that's what I just got from the bear. Oxygen tank. I got that earlier. We still don't have the stabilizer, wherever that is. Juno's hatch key has to find. Cargo bay key, I remember getting a while back. Deflector shield, we still don't have. Vila's hatch key, I do remember getting. Radar dish is something we had. Finn is something I got handed to me earlier. Lupus is hatch key. I still have to figure out where I can use him for that. A fuse, whatever I need for that. And the nitrogen tank is what I just got. Okay, so nitrogen tank and power cell are the two things I recently acquired. Well, just having Vila here, you can get the ship part. So that alone is good to remember that you can use Vila to actually get some of this stuff. Fireplace doesn't hurt, though. I can walk and fire me just fine. What is with these freaking ammunition things? Oh yeah, she doesn't have the shuriken. She doesn't have the, uh... She has the shuriken. Like, what weapon does she not have? Well, I guess I gotta figure that out. The hard way. Whatever weapon it could be, I have no idea. But I do have time mines now. Which are nice, I guess. But not really that useful. Fish food. Not that fish food is helpful either. Okay, so there's gotta be a way to be able to climb up. To be able to reach the rest of the tribals. Because so far from what I'm looking at, I don't see a way to climb. Is that somewhere to get fuel or somewhere I haven't been that I need to figure out how to get to? Oh man, you can see like the divider of where this world cuts off. Jeez. Not very fun that, huh? You limited my creative space! How dare you! Maybe you don't want to be here at all. If only there was a way to get up there. The bear is gone, though. No more bear. Which is honestly a good thing. Never been a fan of bears. I'm wandering around getting ready to pounce at a moment's notice. Huh, if only she could grab on or something. There's gotta be a way up there to reach those tribals. I feel like there's gotta be some sort of platform I can use to give myself jet fuel. Otherwise, I do not see how I can get up here. Nothing else to climb, nothing else to really like use to hover over. Hmm. Well, ooh, let me follow this path. Oh wait, that was the path that takes me back to my ship, right? Yep. Oh, there's another one here. Hi, buddy. Did not see you there. Would you like to come along with me? Well, you don't have a choice. You're coming anyway. Get in the bag. 
Do I have a bag to put them in? <coughs> That's a good question. Sorry about that. Where am I placing them when I save them? I hope it's not some sort of bag I'm placing them in. But they could suffocate. Eh, who knows. Oh yeah, I just noticed if I hold B, I level myself and just went forward without having to worry about falling. That's nice. I don't have to worry about falling if I just swim normally. Okay, there's an area somewhere where I should probably be able to get jet fuel. I just don't know where it is yet. And until I find it, I'm just gonna swim around and hope I find something. I just wish I had a hint as to where it could be. Oh, there's no trouble behind my ship. Damn, dude, you're gonna just hop aboard the ship. Why have to hide? Asshole. Freaking hiding away. Think I'll get us through this place any faster. Nope. Not at all. Well, I found half easily. Now I was just reaching up to the other half. Right, I keep forgetting the X and Y buttons on the Xbox controller still shuffle weapons. So, I gotta remember that. It could be helpful so I don't have to keep going to the D-pad. Because I remember one of the complaints of this game is the awkward controls, and I still feel it every time. Every goddamn time. If only somebody could wall jump. That makes more sense as to how I can get up there, but... Until I see something that makes sense, I have to assume that I can either climb up something that I'm not seeing, can jump up and reach something to be able to grab a ledge, maybe. Hmm. Which I've seen her and Juno both grab ledges. Or is that something only Juno can do? Hmm. You know what? It might be a Juno thing. He might be the only one who grab ledges. I don't know for sure. But I'm going to be different. I'm going to time warp until I figure out exactly how to get those freaking punk-ass tribals always hiding from me, making things so hard for me to do. Well, at least for all my scrambling around, I made it so everybody else can get the time mines. So there we go. Everybody has them now. And yeah, bro, Loop is here because I realized okay, there's one way I can get up to these platforms easily. It's using the hovering. Because I forgot. Hovering is easy. It makes it so much easier to climb up anything, really. As long as, of course, I'm not stupid and fall off. So I just have to make sure that I land properly to grab all the tribals. Ugh, it's a thin path, but God damn it, it is clearly easy to walk on. Oh yeah, and then there's that one over there, okay. Yeah, And I got you! Yes! Just like that, you are now safe. I hope you feel grateful, you damn tribals. Hey, the good news is, now everybody else has a new weapon. The good old time mines, which... Tap it! Just goes to proximity mode. Oh, as I hold it... Which I... Yep. Okay. Maybe it's different because it's in the water. Let's see how it works when I do it this way. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it just has a timer, I guess. Something like that. And it's got a time mine, so I would think so. By the way, there we go! I got all the trials here and got two ship parts. Oh, grand! No, it's left just finding everything else I need to do. Which, well, I've said Vila and Lupus, I mean, Vila and Juno. I keep mixing up Juno and Lupus for some reason. Oh, you're going back to Sekhmet. God damn it, dog. You're going to take forever. Ugh. Fine, it's technically a new cutscene, whatever. As long as you have to go back to the planet, all because I... Ugh. Oh, man. 
My throat is getting a little itchy. Oh, man. Are they not drinking enough, or I just feel like crap? One or the other. Ugh. There you go. I could have done this to then have you go for your green key, but you already have it, so it's kind of worthless for you. Yeah, you can just stay here. I'll figure out what I need you later. So! Back to being with Judo when I sent him here. Because now I can probably get all these freaking tribals this time. I wonder if I'm missing any outside the main gate. That'll explain a bit. Shoot his feet! God damn, they really love shooting feet, don't they? Although, there is machine gun ammo there. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's more hanging out down here. Oh, my God. Was this really just a place to hunt down for tribals? I hope not. And again, it might have been. Nothing there. Oh, okay. Just figured I'd check and double check. Well, okay, now you can grab the ledge. So there's one tribal hanging out there. Damn! Alright, I'm getting out of here. But before I do, I need to look around a little more. Because there's a hole here? Yeah, that's why the crate was here. So I can get up here. And there's even more? Jeez. How big is this place? Well... I guess I'll look around out here to see if I can find anything. Oh, tribals! Okay, so the bottom level is where I did find more, but what was the random dead end area then? I don't know. But either way, what the hell? So, what I get here? A new weapon? I wonder. It is. Woo! We found a flamethrower! Uh oh. Remember that Berserk flaming drones can damage your health. Okay, so I could burn enemies alive, but it wouldn't be good for me if I'm not careful. By the way, yay! War stories! Over time, use every weapon in the game. Okay, so that was the last weapon, too. The remote mines and the flamethrower. Well, isn't that nice? Well, hey, good news! I found all the tribals here, too! They were out here at the flamethrower. Alright, so I can try to commit to let everybody get the flamethrower as well, which is an interesting idea. Damn it, I kind of thought it was a waste of time coming here, but... Eh, no ship part. So weird they the dead end there for no reason. You'd think there'd be something hiding there, but no. It's just a waste my frickin' time. Okay. So I got all the tribals there, at least. I'm getting one step closer to getting all the tribals. There's still a few places I haven't got them all yet. I have Phila, Phila stationed at Rith Essa. So maybe I'll go back to her and try to explore more with her. Besides, she has a thing that can get me the mine key, I think. Ah, back at Rith Essa. Now I have the blue key. I can finally get everything here. And well, since Vila's already here, and I notice there's water around, I feel like I should definitely use her. If there's ever water I could possibly swim in, I have to use Vila. I can finally go in there, though. I wonder if I should do that just yet, though. Because I remembered... There's also some tribals up here. Can I get them all right now, though? That's the other question I have. I assume I can? The more important matter is actually getting up there. I wonder if that blue key door is what's going to get me up there. Maybe. You know what? May as well test that theory. There's no point wandering around here if I can't get all the tribals. So, I'm going to check right now. If my theory is right, then that is what will happen. Let's go! There's a giant water passage. I mean, I figured it would be. Ah! Damn it, caught me off guard again. Well, at least now I have every weapon. Or at least I could. I'll have to remember to take everybody back to get the, uh, flamethrower sometime. Which... Oh boy, a flamethrower. does sound exciting. I wonder how well... How good it can actually be. Probably really good, actually. I mean, it's a friggin' flamethrower. They can burn things to the ground. They dimensions on the burning drones, so I guess I probably make drones go out of control, but they can still crash and hit me. So, I should be careful about that. Well, I see some ammo. 
expansion. And some tribals. Well, it was a good thing I came here after all. All right. They know we do intend me to come this way. Hmm. I wonder. Hiding anything in here? I should check everything now. I never know what to expect to find in these things. So I'm just going to make sure they're all... Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more path. You're the ones that unlock the door for me. I just hope they don't let any tribals die along the way. Oh, it's you. That's just wonderful. Hey, where do you think you're going, huh? No, you don't. You're not getting away from me. I'll hunt him down later. You're first. Okay, looks like you're the only one I left behind. Thank God. And yet there's still more. They really want to hide these waterways from my wrath? Damn it, nothing here. Damn it, nothing here. It's just a light. And yeah, I want to jump into it all the same, see if I can fly into it. Mm, one did get away. I hate these assholes who just run and hide. Go back towards the beginning of the stage. Oh, she's not here. Well, I'm just going to hang out. Oh, wait. Ow! Assholes. Man, it's a lot harder than it needs to be. Seriously, grow up. Fight like a man or whatever kind of soldier ant you're supposed to be. I don't know. Fight me harder, damn it. Because you're freaking not trying hard enough. If you're running away, you're definitely not trying hard enough. I just say that straight up. Hi there. Make sure I pick up ammo because I need it because I'm running low now. Get away from me, asshole. No. Bad ants, bad. At least I am getting ammo from these guys. You need to calm down, sir. All right, there we go. He's dead. Huh. Nothing in here? Some of these rooms, man, I just can't tell if there's something going on in here or not. It's hard for me to notice if I'm actually doing the right thing. Move. Seriously, where's these tribals to, like, leave a trail or something? And then you get caught by the enemy, stupid. Yeah, but... I'd see them before they got killed. You know, they can rely on me like that. I'm not that much of a monster, I would just let them die. You say you might go to a place where they're gonna die if you kill all these guys? Saved ya! Alright. I had a feel that was coming. Usually when they're in a circular dead-end room like this, that's usually what that means. Well, I'll be able to enjoy getting killed. Take this, you monstrosities. <coughs> Ugh, God. They're ruining me. I keep coughing because of these pricks. Ugh. I kind of wish I could have something to scratch back my throat that wouldn't let me throw up. I've been having this itch for like a while now. Oh god, grenades! That figures you would be using grenades. Oh no, no, never mind. You're just launching your rocket thing you always have. Well, never mind then. Thank you for dying for me. So, into the prison cell, whatever this is? <coughs> oh, that's where you two are. Okay, I know where the last two are. They're further down the path. Ooh, shocker capacity. Okay. So this path was literally just to get tribals. Well, that just figures. All right, to the end of this path, I guess we'll end the episode. Because it'll be by the guy that has the mine key, so... You know. I may as well, you know... Try to kill all these assholes. And save those last tribals that are left behind. There are two in the same area. If I remember, I don't want to kill them too quickly because... There are big guys that are guarding the other tribals. Ah! Okay, bye. Have fun. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Oh, wait, you are the bed bugs. The bed bugs are what? Rampant! Oh, I'm glad I got that before it fell. I'm so glad I got that before it fell. Oh, what a pain in the neck that would have been. 
Well, it's obvious I couldn't let... Well, I was gonna say I couldn't let Lupus go through that area. I completely forgot. He can't do anything on water. He, I don't have the blue key with him anyway, so... Wouldn't have really been that helpful anyway. Damn, I got a lot of machine gun ammo. Remember, they're right there. They're right there. Be careful with how, who you kill and how you kill them. It's fine. As long as I only aim upward. Kill the big guys. Uh, aim upward, please. No! God damn it. Oh. That sucks. All right. Let me time warp to freaking getting that done again. Son of a bitch. All right. I'm here again. This time I'm just going to get by you and... Ah! No! Excuse me. I saved them. Now, if you don't mind, I'm trying to get around you. Bye. Ha! Well, that always works. All I do is figure just get past them. It only sucks I hit that ant and then he decided to throw a freaking grenade like a dick. Freaking Mizar are the worst, man. I can't believe that. He just freaking realized he was going to get killed, so he freaking decided to kamikaze. Always with the kamikazes. Fuck you, man. Give me your head. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yep. Oh, no, that's her! Die, die! <laughs> Abandoned ship! We're not on the ship anymore. Abandoned the ship part! We don't need those! They're gonna kill us! We can't have them! Ah, right, right, right! All this friggin' legion of these ships. Can I leave? Nope. Ah! Please don't lose your last life. Uh-oh. Ooh. Yeah, I fell on my first trip here, too. Why are you back here again? Stop! Run! Oh. I guess ah, they revive on their way back. Okay. Okay, so, either they all ran back here, or the enemies I didn't kill ended up reviving. They're still running off the cliff, man. I hear those big guys came back. Yep. Only the enemies that you did not kill get resurrected. Right. I guess some run off the cliff, they disappear, but they don't technically die. Hmm. I wonder if that means they just fall off and they just hang out at the bottom of the map. Makes sense, because I guess they don't really technically count their death unless they're, like, shot apart and they actually have to disappear. I'm guessing, I'm guessing if they just, you know, fall, they don't actually have a moment to die. They just wander off down there. Where if your character falls down there, they're warped back up and they lose a continue. Oh, finally. All right. With that, I'm going to end this episode here, because holy crap, a lot has happened. It's more and more tribal, it's more and more places. I found every weapon in the game now. All that's left is to try to find where everything else is. The rest of the ship parts, whatever remaining Floyd missions I have, and, um, yeah, ship parts and tribals. So, come back next time. More exploration awaits. Who knows where we're going to end up? I don't, because I'm hoping to swim into something or walk through lava. As far as I know, Lupus is going to be completely useless to me from this point forward. Unless his hovering is actually necessary for something again.